guys, this is Assassin and for this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can use FTP black box for 4.50 CFW and um, it's pretty much just works for all CFWs on 4.xx, I'm not sure about the 3.55s and below uh, you can get it from store virology or the download link in the description that I have for you guys now what you need to do is put it on a USB device plug it into your PS3 and then go to install PKG and install it and um, and once you've done so it should show up below your game on the homebrew where all the other homebrew does and um, I'm just going to show you guys how to use it so here's the PKG file what you want to do is download FileZilla now um, launch FTP black box which I just did um, I'll show you guys on the PS3 um, what it'll look like whenever you do have it open and um, we're gonna upload an NW2 patch with that so first of all um, when you open black box type in your IP address that it gives you and then right here and hit enter and uh, click OK but that's not gonna pop up for you guys and when it says directory listing successful on the right side where it says remote side you need to go to dev underscore hdd0 and then game in all lowercase and then find blus30377 and then user dir and then this patch underscore mp.ff we're going to replace so over on the left side where it says local site click on your desktop and once you've done that just scroll down and find the mod menu you want or wherever you have it located um, mine I'm going to use a uh, whitewater b5.0 so when I find it I'll uh, get it open if it's in an archiver like that you just click on it once right click click open then go in the folder directory and uh, get your your file this is for bless and bless then just drag it over and if it's over on this side just click on it and drag it over here and click on overwrite ok and then once it's done it says uh, successful you also need to find default underscore mp dot self click on it once right click click delete click yes and then that's it now on your ps3 you can just hit x if your screen is completely black and hit x again and then it'll close out of that and for this you can just close it down if you're going to use it later or close out of it entirely so I'll meet you guys back on the PS3 and I'll show you what it should look like on black box and I will show you also what we do after we upload the patch okay guys and then once you're back on it if it's uh, been sitting there for a while and it goes black just hit X and it should look like that and now it says FTP what V 1.2 um, FTP server v1.2 press x to exit IP is 192.168.0. whatever or whatever your IP address is um, but anyways that's what it'll look like and when you're done with the file transfer on FileZilla just close out of uh, hit x to exit and then close out of FileZilla and since we did the whitewater v5.0 patch for mw2 and deleted that one file because um, that's what you do for mw2 um, that's what you do for MW2 uh, 1.11 patches and since this patch is made on 1.11 and only works for that um, we had to delete that file that way we could um, you know use it because it's for 1.11 like I said now once you've uh, launched anti band programs just go and sign in and then once you sign in just launch MW2 and we'll be all good to go. Just go to multiplayer. and hit play online and then go to private match and make sure that your patch is working that way you know for sure
private match start. Auto sign, choose any other class. Now, if you see the custom writing in the bottom left corner, that means it worked. And if you hit up and it opens, it worked. So, um, yeah, just go to host menu and, uh, force host has been, uh, enabled, as you can see. Now, thanks for watching, guys. That's how you, um, use FileZilla to do any file transfer. I just use this for example because I was about to upload this, anyways. So thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in my next tutorial.